So eGamer responded to my video on him, and I'm going to be blunt, it's about as good as you'd expect a video which begins by openly speculating on if I'm trans to be. At least I don't have a picture of a fucking anime girl in my background. What is this shit? Is this another tranny? Two things. One, the avatar I use is not an anime girl. It's not even a girl, let alone one from an anime, so that's just wrong on both accounts. And two, I'm not transgender? I don't know where you got that idea. Honestly, the main thing I want to point out about this video is, despite its intention of, I assume, debunking me and making fun of me, eGamer actually agrees with me quite a lot throughout it. So you weren't talking about the quality of his videos, but you said he made bad videos. Like, look at you. You see, the thing I like most about this point is how he's essentially admitting he's wrong, but just attempts to excuse it by saying somebody else was wrong, and also, he was wrong in a way that doesn't actually matter. Well, I mean, pretty much, yeah. Again, you don't actually do anything to disprove what Creeper says. Yes, because it's a nitpicky and geeky talking point. You just go, well, joke's on you, I've arbitrarily decided it doesn't matter. Like, look at you. Well, I guess we all learned a valuable lesson today. If you are wrong about something, you should both say it doesn't matter, and then spend one dodecatillion words defending it. Like, look at you. I mean, in a way, Ephraim is right. Of course, this is when he's not declaring that actually the video wasn't meant to be taken seriously, and he just did it for attention. It's a little side insult that I did for comedic relief, which was the main point of my video. You could tell from my video that I wasn't actually trying to make a good case against Communist Creeper. I was just A, trying to get attention, and B, trying to make a funny video where I just fucked with him. Once again, I would like to stress, I made the video for attention, and I got a lot of attention for it, so thank you very much. And I'm going to get even more attention by making this video. I like views. Views are pretty good. Like when you just see the amount of people that watch your video, it's relevant. It's influence. It's great. So by responding to me, you're just showing me to people who either like me or don't. So what's that gonna do? Because if you're doing something for attention, obviously you would loudly declare that. Which would therefore make people less likely to give you attention. I'm just saying this seems like you're attempting to show yourself as so smart because you're out here playing 4D chess when you can't just admit you're bad at making arguments. And to end this video off, I'll discuss his argumentative skills. For a sample, remember how I said that he incorrectly said that Creeper's video on Matt Walsh was him calling Matt transphobic, when in actuality it was about asexuality? Well, here's how eGamer responded to that. It's still LGBTQ. All this LGBTQ stuff is pretty much the same shit. Yes, I know there's small differences in it, but talking about asexuality and talking about transgenderism, my criticism of him using pointless buzzwords and just using the same leftist mainstream mumbo jumbo still applies here. If you actually watch his video, it is essentially just calling him homophobic and just small gotcha moments where he uses buzzwords. So you have nothing to substantiate your claim and the best retort you can get essentially comes down to moving the goalpost. You said he calls people transphobic. You didn't say he talks about LGBT shit. Yeah, your arguments are still of the same quality, so I'm just fucking ending it here. Good night and good luck.